including an animist into our campaign means that we had to look seriously at magic points. For this reason, we decided to tackle tenacity. When spirits start to enter into your campaign, we all have to remember that spirit combat will follow pretty soon. When this happens, the damage from spirit combat is applied as default to magic points. However, in our magically rich campaign, I didn't want spirit combat to have a negative effect on the other casters, draining them of their power as they fought spirits. So we decided to implement the optional rule and brought tenacity into the game. And if you stay tuned right to the end of the video, I'll let you know how easy the change is to apply to your campaigns. So tenacity is an additional attribute that is based off the character's power rather than using magic points as a measure of the character's resilience when dealing with things from the spirit world tenacity points are used instead. When damage is done to the character by a spirit the damage is rolled as usual but it is not deducted from the character's magic points. Instead, it's taken from the character's tenacity points. This maintains the pool of magic points solely for characters to fuel their spells. However, it must be remembered that tenacity points are only used to track the psychological endurance of engaging in spirit combat they cannot be used to power spells as well. Sorry spell users, you still just have to use your magic points. Once the character's tenacity points have been reduced to zero, then their will to withstand sp a spirit attack is depleted and they will be unable to avoid the consequences of defeat. But luckily for characters, tenacity points lost in spirit combat recover every 24 hours, provided that they are suitably rested and fed and watered. You, you get the idea. All the information about using tenacity can be found on page 139 of the core rulebook. There is also an option to use tenacity, and I quote, for resisting corruption, experiencing battle fatigue, suffering addictions and facing supernatural forces in historical settings and so forth. So how easy is it to slip tenacity into your campaigns? Well, if you use paper character sheets, you only need to add another attribute called tenacity, which is equal to the character's power points. If you use Roll20, like us, then the Mithras character sheet already has this option available. You just need to go into your campaign settings and turn it on. So click on the cog and then go to campaign settings and you can go down to the attribute section and choose the enable tenacity from the drop down menu. If you found this or any of my videos helpful or entertaining, then please consider liking, commenting and subscribing. And if you would like to provide further support, then please consider using the super thanks donate button or consider becoming a supporter of the channel, which gives you early access to videos and an exclusive monthly video where I discuss my ideas and tasks for the future. Until next time, I hope all your opposed roles are successful and you cling on desperately to those tenacity points in spirit combat. Thanks for watching everyone. See ya. Bye.